All right, you guys, you know what time it is? Grocery time. Now I get to tell you what I got for the week. Welcome to Dia's Frugal Life. My name is Dia. And if you enjoy the content, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell for more future videos. Okay, here we go. Today I spent $31.26. And what did I get? Bam. Not very much this time for over $30. But I went ahead and got my usual five pound sack of potatoes. I got a big uh, container of this chicken bouillon. This is gonna last me forever, guys. And then I got um, onion powder and more garlic powder. I grabbed some sugar, some white vinegar. And on this side we have apples, zucchini, onion, bananas, carrots, then I got some tortillas this time, you guys. So I won't be eating all of it. I'll be freezing a lot of it, probably most of it. So there's some of this stuff here that is gonna last me way more than the week or the month, but you know, it, it helps out for next month. I don't have to buy this or I don't have to worry about getting things like this and I can get something else. So that's just how that goes. And then for Cora, I got a four pack of tuna. Plus, she requested some more breakfast sausage. So I went ahead and got her a, a pound of breakfast sausage. And that's, that's all I got, you guys. That is it. So I plan on making um, coleslaw. I got more carrots and I still have cabbage in the fridge. So I'm going to be doing that. And I have mayo also. So I'm going to be doing some basic coleslaw. Um, I don't know if I've tried it maybe once before, but I'm going to try to make coleslaw see how that turns out and then of course i love to snack on apples and peanut butter i still got a bunch of peanut butter and then i've been on a zucchini and carrot shredded kick to make um i'm gonna call it loaded spaghetti sauce loaded veggie spaghetti sauce so i do that with this um also i might just do one zucchini like that and then another zucchini i'll shred it up with some onion and mix it with eggs for a few breakfasts. And then you guys already know I do my banana with oatmeal. Potatoes, I just bake them in the microwave. And uh, yeah, that's what I got, you guys. I still have a ton of uh, frozen vegetables and a ton of rice, a ton of beans, pasta, um, oats. I've got, I've got a lot of food, you guys, I really do. But as far as like the fresh stuff and then just a little bit odd and end stuff to make different dishes because it gets kind of boring sometimes doing the same thing. But yeah, this is what I got you guys. So last time I believe I had $35 left and I spent $31.26. So I have three, four-ish dollars left and that'll be for next week. I'll purchase some more uh, vegetables. But other than that, I'm pretty I'm pretty loaded on a ton of food as far as my basic, my rice, my beans, my oats, my pasta, stuff like that. I've got a lot of it. I just need to replenish, you know, weekly my fruits and veggies, but so far so good and I will attempt to do this coleslaw and hopefully I'll film it and show you guys and we'll see what it tastes like. We'll experiment together. Then I want to do some more um I want to do some instant pot videos for you guys, more prepping videos, more um, frugal meals, and so on and so forth. So look forward to that, and bye guys. Look at here, you guys. Meal prep, meal prep for me. Um, I ended up getting uh, these containers that are divided. I got a set of those. And I'm going to start doing a lot of like single meal preps to take to lunch to work. Because of course, yes, I've got me a job now. So, um, yeah, it'll just make it easier. Plus, I'm still doing the bigger meal preps where I have like the whole container filled. So, like these kind right here. This is the eight, eight cup. And this is a five cup. But the one that came with this, the set, is a five and a half cup, I believe. 
So this one's just a teeny bit um, smaller, but I went ahead and got me one of these because it's just handy to take to work. So this is what I do when I go to work. I will have one prep ready to go. Um, probably have maybe two in the freezer just in case, but I'll, I'll typically prep my, my lunch the night before, so yeah. That's what I'm doing now, guys. And of course, this is just um, the frozen bag of broccoli and cauliflower. My typical baked potato, and this is the red sauce. What I call the, the loaded, loaded veggie uh, red sauce, spaghetti sauce. So I have carrots, zucchini, and a little bit of onion in here. Plus whatever other um, fruits and veggies that it has already. But yeah, you guys, I'm gonna be showing you more often what I meal prep to, to take to work. See, look, it looks ginormous there, doesn't it? <laughs> but, I mean, it is a pretty good size, so I'm not gonna go hungry, so here we go. The frozen milk, and yeah, that's how you save money, you guys, with a tiny little fridge. Whatever I can freeze, I freeze. And then I'm gonna make a couple more of these and freeze them also. Um, yeah, take advantage when I don't have to go to work. Take advantage and meal prep that day. That way I can just chill and don't have to worry about it. Just giving you a little screenshot of the zucchini and carrots that I grated, along with one pound of ground turkey. Yum. Anyway, so I've got these two containers, maybe four or five cups of sauce in each one. So I'll just close these up, pop them in the freezer until we're ready to, to enjoy them. And then I'll just bring one out and put it in the little fridge and then we'll enjoy it throughout the week.